Hi everyone, are you good? Today I want to take an opportunity to discuss a topic related to interpreting and teaching. Last month in the email that I sent out, that discussed recent events with the hurricane where there were a few interpreters who had the news spotlight on them. Well, one was good and one was bad. But anyway, the point is that a few people asked me about interpreters for the deaf versus teaching the deaf and what the difference is. Okay, so today I'll discuss. Interpreting, and that's the sign, interpreting. Interpreting means really the focus is on communication. It's empowering people to communicate and interact. For example, maybe you are deaf and you go to the doctor. The doctor is hearing, so they speak, don't know ASL, and you're deaf, so when you go, how do you communicate? You need an interpreter. The interpreter is a third person who comes in, the doctor speaks, and the interpreter signs, and then you understand. And then you sign, the interpreter will speak, and explain for the doctor. And that relay goes back and forth. Another example might be in a presentation or a play, if someone is on stage speaking, there might be an interpreter on the side signing, and then if there's someone at deaf in the audience, they'll understand. And that's interpreting. Now on to teaching. Teaching means I know something and I want to impart that knowledge onto you, so I teach. Now teaching, I want to discuss two types, and understand that both interpreters and teachers, there are many, many different types. Um, I just want to give you a little bit of an intro now, but if you want to learn more in depth, you can definitely do so. Anyway, teaching, there are two kinds related to the deaf. One would be teaching ASL. Now understand, teaching ASL means the language is what you're teaching. For example, me. I'm an ASL teacher which means I teach ASL. On YouTube, Instagram, in the classroom, one-on-one, -on -one, I teach, meaning I know ASL. You want to learn, so I teach you. The students can be deaf, hearing, hard of hearing, it doesn't matter. The point is that they don't know ASL and want to learn it. So they need an ASL teacher. The second kind of teacher is about deaf education. Deaf education means that the students are deaf. The student maybe signs, maybe reads lips, maybe has an implant. Really, students can be diverse. But if you're a teacher of the deaf, that means that you can be deaf hearing, hard of hearing, it doesn't matter. Your students are deaf. Does it mean you teach ASL? No, probably not means you probably are teaching math or science, history, art, gym, really anything. The subject doesn't matter. If your students are deaf, then that means deaf. you a teacher of the deaf, children or adults. Okay? I hope that that clears that up to understand the different kinds of teachers plus what interpreters do. If you have other questions, please let me know. Comment, email me. I hope you have a good week. Bye.